my gosh. It is an absolutely spectacularly gorgeous. We are talking about an over-the-top beautiful postcard perfect day here in the end times and paradise and uh, heading to Inverness, Florida to do a little planet eating <coughs> real estate developing uh, <laughs> down here in the swamp in Inverness. Uh, so anyway, you know, I, I did this rant last night about eclipse morons, about all of these clueless fucking morons, you know, coming from all over the country, all over the goddamn planet, spending hundreds if not thousands of fucking dollars to, to watch this eclipse on, uh, on Monday. Uh, just unbelievable. The, the flood of morons uh, just uh, thinking that this solar eclipse is the coolest fucking thing uh, that, is, that, that has happened to this planet, I, I don't know, since, uh, since the invention of smartphones, maybe. I don't know what's going through these clueless fucking morons' heads. So, so I do that rant about those fucking morons. Then I get up this morning and, and I turn on the mainstream media and good fucking God, the, uh, the, the mainstream media. It, it's just this eclipse on Monday ha has just taken over the world, basically, this fucking distraction. So, of course, they have a hundred articles as if you don't know by now where to see the eclipse. So they, they got that hundred articles, but then there's a whole nother slew of articles today talking about these absolute clueless fucking morons on the complete other side of the uh, Marana scene. That, that there's, uh, you, you, you got the, I, I guess we can call them, what are we going to call them, the, the pro-eclipse clueless fucking morons. But now, apparently, there is an entire fucking uh, movement in the conspiracy wacko world. This was the second biggest story on the planet this morning about the, the, these fucking uh, mostly right-wing uh, you know, anti-science conspiracy wackos. Alex Jones is out there, uh, of course, uh, in the pack, and all of these fucking uh, TikTokers and all of this shit with, with, with all of these goddamn conspiracy theories being built around the, the eclipse. It, it, it's just, I mean, the flat earthers, are offering up this eclipse as ironclad proof that the Earth is flat, and you can see this on Monday. Uh, they're, they're saying anybody, uh, how can you deny the Earth is flat after uh, after watching this eclipse on Monday? Uh, so I mean, starting with them and and good fucking God. Uh, it, it, <laughs> <laughs> there, there must be 20 articles, uh, you know, I guess from the pro-eclipse camp uh, laughing at the uh, clueless fucking morons in the anti-eclipse camp who are laughing at the clueless fucking morons in the pro-eclipse uh, camp. And here I am one more time just like I was with Corona Panic, stuck in the fucking middle again, going, oh my God, am I here all alone. I got these fucking uh, morons on both sides of me, uh, screaming. They're, they're, they're fucking freak out. I, 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 anyway, guys, uh, so I, I, I read these... <laughs> I, I, I read a couple of these articles. 
uh, uh, about these conspiracy wacko morons and, and, and all of the j j just unadulterated horseshit coming out of their mouth. And so <laughs> I get in my truck and I call my buddy uh, d down here in Florida. Great guy. Uh, he is not the... The, the the most he is not a master at, <laughs> at discernment and critical thinking he is a big Fox News uh, listener I honestly don't think he's not a MAGA <clears throat> uh, level more now he despises correctly Joe Biden but he's not a big uh, Donald Trump fan either I, I, I mean he just like just dis uh, despises Joe Biden and Donald Trump uh, for just different reasons than I despise Joe Biden and Donald Trump so he's not a MAGA moron but he is a big Fox News listener and, and, and some of the shit that, that's come out of his mouth. So anyway, I just got off the phone with this fellow. Really nice guy. And he's this big dude. I, he, he, you know what I'm saying. I, I, I mean, he, he's a big dude. I don't consider this guy to live in fear. Uh, <laughs> that's one thing that, that I don't uh, say about this guy. So I call him up to see if he wants to come out on this beautiful day and earn a few dollars this weekend uh, drag and brush around and he said that he has other plans so I'm, uh, I, I'm, I'm you know talking to him about what days he has available so I mentioned Monday and he, and he goes Monday uh, he, he goes uh, he goes I assume that you're not going to be down there uh, outside uh, dragging brush on Monday. And, and I said, well, I, I said it depends on the temperature. I said, why? I, I, I said, where are you going to be on Monday? And he goes, I'm going to be in my goddamn house. I'm not stepping foot out of this house on Monday. And, and I said, what? Uh, and he goes, I'm not letting the dog out of my house on Monday. Poor dog. I don't know where this dog is going to piss and shit. I said, I said, brother, what in the fuck are you talking about? Uh, I, I said, I think the temperature is going to be 81 degrees on Monday. And, 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 he, and he goes, I'm talking about that eclipse. And I said, what? I, I said, we don't even have the eclipse in Florida. And he goes, well... We got over 50% of that eclipse. And uh, he, he, he goes, I, I'm sure it's not hell uh, stepping out in, in, in all of that radiation coming out of that eclipse. And, and, and he goes, you need to, uh, he goes, you need to stay inside, Sam. And, and he goes, you have got to keep Sancho uh, inside all day Monday. Like, I'm keeping my night. I said, I said, what does a 50% solar eclipse have to do with Sancho and he goes and he goes well it's all over it, 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 it's all over out there that if your dog if, if your dog looks up towards that eclipse on Monday he will be blinded he will be blinded that dogs uh, and he starts telling me something about fucking uh, uh, how dogs Something about their eyes. I, I, I guess that 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 if, that if Sancho Panza glances up at the sun on Monday, the back of his eyeballs will be fried. I'm I'm talking, you know, a, a one second glance. He goes, no way I'm letting my dog out of the house uh, to get blinded uh, by all that radiation coming out of that uh, out of that eclipse and and, uh, and and then he goes and he goes and sure as hell uh, sure as hell Sam don't be pointing don't be pointing your cell phone camera 
uh, up there at, at that damn thing on Monday, and and I I, I said pointing my cell phone uh, at, at the uh, eclipse, and he goes, well, he goes, he goes, you know, all of these fucking people uh, out there uh, thinking they're going to be getting cell phone photos and videos. Well, you put your cell phone and you point it at that eclipse and it was that radiation is going to burn up your cell phone. And I said, so I'm assuming what we're going to read about uh, Monday night, dude, it, it is all of the millions of cell phones that have been uh, burned up by the radiation coming out of uh, of the eclipse, and, and he goes, like, you're, you're, "You're damn straight." And, and uh, then, then he starts talking. Now, this one might be true. Uh, uh, okay, uh, about all of the fucking clueless fucking morons uh, out there heading to Austin, Texas, or wherever, who are gonna fuck up their eyes. Uh, I, I, I guess one of the theories going around, particularly in the flat earther community, is they are encouraging people to look directly at the eclipse with no glasses whatsoever. No glasses whatsoever to look directly at the eclipse. That, uh... uh that these glasses, what, what is the meme going around that these glasses are not uh, to protect your eyes, they are to protect their lies. That these glasses are, it's a conspiracy by these uh, people who believe the earth is round. Uh, <clears throat> and revolving around the sun. Uh, it, 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 anyway, but at least my buddy hasn't heard that one. Uh, but, but, you know, he's talking about these clueless fucking morons, even with, even with uh, th their glasses, who are, are going to be burning their fucking eyeballs on the sun. Uh <laughs> And, and, and I said, dude, uh, I said, I, he has never been through a solar eclipse. He's 55. So I guess he missed the one <clears throat> that, well, I was in the Okefenokee Swamp when I was a kid. He might have been a little baby because uh, I feel like it was about 55 years ago. I, 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 I said, dude, I, I said, I have been through two completely solar eclipses, the last one in 2017 up there in Washington State. I guess that one was, they didn't talk about that one down here in Florida. He had no memory of a total solar eclipse in 2017, acting like I'm fucking crazy. And, uh, <laughs> so, uh, <clears throat> He's never been through one, so I reminded him, dude, I have been through two solar eclipses in my life, including one with Sancho in 2017. I uh, said, out there in, uh, in, in Washington State, and we sat right there, me and Sancho, uh, sat through that solar eclipse, from beginning to end, uh, I'm not blind, Sancho's not blind, somehow, uh, we, we made it, uh, we, we made it out alive, oh, God, you know, the, 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 the clueless fucking morons on this planet, I mean, it, it doesn't matter where you turn, it does not matter where you turn, but speaking of turning, I do not want to hit this Harley. I am at Chicken King. Chicken King. Uh, 
God, is this a line to get into Chicken King? I gotta load up on some uh, gotta load up on some grease and some sweet iced tea to start my day uh, I'm uh, attacking the grape vines from hell is my job today anyway <laughs> get out there and enjoy the stampede of morons as we get closer and closer to Monday and pray for rain on Monday. Bye guys.